if you look at Western academies, universities, who are the people teaching the Jewish history, Jewish scholars? Who are the people teaching European history, mostly Christians and seculars? Who is teaching the Islamic history? Who is teaching the Islamic history is the question. It is the Jewish scholars, Christian scholars, atheistic scholars, or in some cases outright, you know, uh, people who have no beliefs or anything like that. People who have no beliefs at all, they have nothing to defend. Even they are teaching the Muslim history. But when it comes to the English language in the Western world, very few Muslims are involved in the history of study, unfortunately. Uh, you have to study it and doing so will give you the ability to defend your civilization. Where there are virtues, where there are achievements, where there are luminaries to defend, you will defend them effectively because you know the history. But if you don't know your history, your enemies will throw partial history at you or distorted form of your history at you or lies, outright lies at you and you won't be able to defend because you are, you are simply not aware whether this is even your history or not. Mm-hmm.